Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathy. If you're new, welcome. Uh, today I'm doing a collaboration with Katie from Vintage and Vinyl, Dolores from Miss Dam Jewelry, and from Beth from Carolina Princess Sweet Treats and Pretties. That's a mouthful. <laughs> um, the theme is Bring Back the Glass or Bring Back the Clear Glass in 2022. So there's some there's a little campaign going on to bring back the clear glass. So I'm going to show you the pieces, some of the pieces that I have. I have probably I have quite a bit of clear glass. Most of it is barware. Um, some of it I inherited from my mother. Some of it I got at um, you know yard sales and thrift stores. So I'm just going to show you a few pieces here, and all of these pieces I think I've got at either yard sales or thrift stores. So they're all thrifted items. Um, I'm gonna start off with this piece that I just recently got. And this is absolutely beautiful. Um, it's a, a wedding cake topper, or it could also be like an anniversary. It's date, because there is a date on it, and I think it's um, 1992. Where's my glasses, maybe that would help out. Um, actually, I take that back. It's 2002. I am so blind. I need new glasses. None of my glasses are working very good. But it's made in the Czech Republic. And look how beautiful this is. So it's clear glass. I don't, it could be crystal. I don't really know. Um, it's just a small piece. But isn't that beautiful? And of course, that color goes with everything. It, there is a little red, um, rhinestone in there but I just thought that was so so pretty and that will be pretty in a display I thought maybe even I might put this in my um, Valentine display so if I remember I will take pictures of how I use some of these items and I'll put the pictures at the end of the video if I remember <laughs> I don't have a very good memory lately um, another clear glass item that I have is this darling little dog Look at how sweet that little puppy dog is. I think I've seen these in different colors. I'm not really sure. Um, they were a candy container. So I believe there was candy inside and then there was probably like a paper uh, cover on it to keep the candy intact. And it's pretty old. I'm thinking like the 30s or the 40s. But isn't that darling? And you could probably put a little light inside him. Maybe a little fairy lights but isn't he cute? Or it could go on with, um, well, you'll see, I have some other glass items. So I'm gonna show you my glass critters first. So I've got this little puppy. I have another little dog, and this is another uh, crystal one, and it's from, I think it's Princess House Pets. So another little puppy dog. So imagine these critters. Um, I have another dog. This one is, uh, I think it's Crystal D'Arc. Um, I just actually remember that, and I don't know if it's on here somewhere. Let's see. It doesn't say, but I think it's Crystal D Art, if I can, if I can remember correctly. Yeah, I don't see anything in there. It's frosted, like satin or frosted on the bottom. It's clear on the top. Just beautiful. Again, you could put lights underneath it, or can you imagine what I was going to say is to have like having all these like dogs with some colorful lights behind it. Wouldn't they be pretty? Even clear lights I think would be pretty because they kind of remind me of ice, especially this one. It looks like an ice sculpture. I just think it's so pretty. And then I have one more little critter. And this one is a frosty glass also, or satin, and it's a turtle. There's no markings on it that I can see. Um, I don't think that's a mark on the bottom. But look at how pretty my little turtle is. It's beautiful. So I, so that's that's um, the extent of my critters that I'm showing you. I think I have some other ones. I think I have a rabbit and I might have a cat. I'm not sure. Um, I just picked up this little guy recently. I think at a yard sale. Look at how pretty that is. 
It's a little top hat. I don't know who makes this. It could be left in, it could be Princess House. I really don't know. But it's just so pretty and shimmery. And I'm hoping that little, the shimmer is coming up. The, the way that the light just bounces off those little diamond cuts. It's actually daisy and button, but it's so pretty and shimmery. And then I have this little toothpick holder and I'm, let me see if there's a name on this one. I thought there was. These are the wrong glasses. I really can't see with these. Um, it does say something, I think. Maybe it's just some little scribbly lines. Oh, it looks like, it looks like an N, the letter N is in Nancy, with an arrow going down the middle. So I didn't look it up, so I don't know who makes that. And I don't know if you could see it, because I know it's hard to see um, when it's on clear glass, the etching, but there is a little etching in there. But I thought that was pretty. I use this for my tear tray. So when I decorate the tear trays, I use these. I have this one, I also have a purple one. Um, you could put like, this is a little ring. Look how pretty that is on top of that. And that might go in my St. Patrick's Day, or not St. Patrick's Day my Valentine's Day display. I think that might be cute, so I don't know. When I do it, I'll take a picture, because I, I need to do that really soon, maybe even today. And then I have um, this little clear trinket box. Very pretty. And again, um, with lights in it, um, or you can put your jewelry in there. You can put candy or nuts in there. Just about anything in there. So, so pretty. And again, you know, um, on a dresser, like on a glass, um, you know, like a glass tray with other glass items and lights, wouldn't that be absolutely beautiful? And then I have this champagne bucket. And I love picking these up because these are just so, so pretty. And I use this for um, Christmas time. And I might even use it for Valentine's Day. And you can just put like your ornaments in there. I just, I haven't put away my, all my Christmas decorations yet. So we'll just see. These are some vintage ornaments. And just look at how pretty that is, how it shows through. And then if you have a light behind it, oh, just beautiful. So pretty. You could put flowers in here. You could do just about anything, but it's very pretty. It's nice with your, um, on a bar, with all your other barware. I have two other ones that are on my, my bar, with all the barware. And then you have the classic, uh, this is a Home Go Fairy Lamp. And this is so versatile because you could put lights in there, you put colored lights, you can put, um, Christmas balls in there. I've done that before. I put like red Christmas balls, little ornaments in there. You could put multicolored ornaments. Um, I'll show you what we did this year is we actually put some Christmas lights. Let me see if I can plug this in. Um, oh goodness. Let's see if this is going to work. Uh-oh. I think I have a short in it. Let's see if this works, but look at how pretty. I don't have the right plug. Hopefully I'll get electrocuted doing this. But these are just little, we call them twinkle lights. And for some reason this plug is not cooperating very good. You, they do have the battery operated ones, but look at how beautiful that is. Isn't that just stunning? So we had this on the table with these lights in it for Christmas and it was really pretty. And I think that's all of my items um, that I'm going to show you. I probably have other clear glass items and I just have them kind of all over the house with my other, other d decor. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I'm going to put the links down below of Katie's channel, Beth's channel, and Dolores' channel. So you can go check them out, subscribe to them. And um, I'm, I'm also, oh, excuse me. <coughs> I have a little tickle in my throat. I will also put a link to the playlist. So 
So go check out everybody else and see how what they did with their clear glass or just, you know, maybe it's just a show and tell. I'm not really sure how everybody's gonna do this. I can't wait to see. But um, go show them some love and uh, subscribe to their channels. And um, that's it. So until next time, I'll see you in my next video. Don't, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Thank you.